This is a video. Any comments? I'm really uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> Lots of water buffalo. Water buffalo!
Well, my name is Larissa. I'm a youth and development volunteer for Peace Corps Thailand. I really hope you liked my video on Buffalo Village. I went with my host family and let me quickly explain why it was such a big deal for me to go to a buffalo farm and why I was so excited when my host family told me that they wanted to take me to one. I'm one of those people that grew up watching Veggie Tales. If you don't know what Veggie Tales is, I'm sure it's on YouTube. The way that Veggie Tales works is that they have episodes that break with an interlude where the cucumber sings a silly song. In one of the episodes, he sings about water buffaloes. Everybody's got a water buffalo. Oh my god. I almost broke its ear. Oh no. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. This thing's not that strong, you know? And in another one, he actually sings about Cebu's. Now, this buffalo farm that I went to had both Cebu's and water buffaloes. And I was so excited. They're so cool. They're so cute. It was so much fun. The veggie tales in my childhood made me super excited to go to this buffalo farm. So I totally forgot to explain why the Buffalo Village was built in the first place. Since the Sukhothai period, which was Thailand's first kingdom up until about 30 years ago, Thai locals heavily depended on water buffaloes to do most of their farm work. They were super loved, almost like pets, they were very respected, and back then it was unheard of to slaughter them for their meat. But now, with the rise of the meat industry, with the rise of modern machines, less and less Thai farmers depend on water buffaloes, and so their numbers are starting to dwindle drastically in Thailand. The Buffalo Village is a really neat way to celebrate the water buffalo's long-standing role in traditional farming in Thailand, and also a way to preserve various kinds of water buffalo. And there's villages all over the country, and it's one of many efforts that have come up in Thailand to help preserve the water buffalo. So if you like the video, like and subscribe. I plan on making more videos, not just on where I travel, but also documenting my experience as a Peace Corps volunteer for the Youth and Development Program in Peace Corps Thailand. Isn't this cute? It's so cute. Bye.